Oh, g'day, guys. Bruce, Drain Cleaning Australia. So just in the middle of a bushwalk here in the Swan Valley, and oh, look, there we go. There's a couple of camera-shy kangaroos. Come on, mate, I don't bite. So, yeah, just going for a little stroll. And I had a phone call from an absolute ripping customer. You know, he's, he's called me up and he said, mate, mate, the, the, me pub in the city, it's we got some drainage dramas, you know. Can you get down? I said, mate, of course I can get down. It's absolutely not a problem. Anyway, guys, look, they're, they're buggering off. There's enough stuffing around for us. It's not bloody National Geographic, you know. We're here to bloody clean drain. So, any, oh, oh, before we shoot, there's a couple of friendly ones. So let's go and say good day to them. Hello, guys. Wait, how are Oh, bloody hell. Okay, no. Also camera shy. Well, I reckon that's our cue to bugger off as well. Guys, put your feet up and enjoy. excited about this one today guys you now we'll take a stroll on into the kitchen here and we'll just have a look and see what the situation is we'll have a look at these sinks hang on what's this is a floor waste here yeah the floor waste is blocked all right got the water running here I think the plug's open. Yeah, look, that valve is in the open position, so it's just not draining away. There's water in that floor waste gully. Can't see too much in there. I'm going to stroll over to the grease trap here. Oh, yeah, no wonder it's not overflowing in the sh in the kitchen or into the uh, into the pub. It's, it's coming out of the grease trap here. Let's get it sorted. And uh, yeah, there we are, guys. Absolutely chock a block right to the top. Yep, that is uh, that is a beautiful sight. Oh, absolutely lovely. Gotta love it. Nothing better, guys. Now, guys, I feel absolutely awkward to ask, but if you could smash the like button, it'd just do absolute bloody wonders for the channel. So I really appreciate it, and guys, thank you very much. Uh, and I guess the reason it does feel bloody weird to ask you guys to like the videos is I, I just don't see myself as a YouTuber, you know? I'm just a plumber, and uh, I think I've, I've told you guys a few times in uh, previous videos. It all started off one day when I sent a mate a, uh, a video of a, dr a block drain. I sent it to him, and he's like, oh, that's disgusting, Bruce, but... I mean, you should upload that onto YouTube, you know. There's a lot of people that would watch that. It's a, it's an absolute ripper of a drain. Anyway, I uh, uploaded a couple of videos, and the rest is history. I think there's, uh, there's 2,000 of us now, guys. So, look, I just say it every time, guys. I'm mind-blowing, oh, and I really appreciate this. Well, here's the, uh, the old plumber's briefcase, and let's pull out our weapon of choice. Oh, bloody hell, I'm going to have to put the phone down for two seconds, guys. And boom, just like that. Magic. Bob's your mother's brother. Anyway, I'll get the multi-grips out. We'll take the uh, the black grate off this drain here. This is the overflow relief gully now that's probably going to be blocked. There we are. Boom. Look at that. Now it's downstream of that. So you can see the uh, the hub is upstream of that it goes through the grease trap here and it's supposed to be going through that overflow relief gully but look, we're blocked we'll send the jet down and we'll see what sort of magic we can whip up eh now look guys I've said it before if you're sitting down to a nice roast dinner or a bit of breakfast this video is not for you I mean cockroaches grease traps I mean, you just got to bloody love it, though, don't you, guys? It's, it's just there's nothing better than a blocked bloody drain. I mean, guys, in the comment section below, you tell me, where would you rather be? 
because I can't figure that one out. I'm quite happy being here clearing drains with you guys. All right, I'm, this is what you call living the bloody dream. Oh yes, you at the back, sir. I can hear someone saying, who's dream? What do you mean, who's dream? This is bloody Bruce Drain Cleaning Australia dream. Oh, oh, oh here we go, guys. And there we have it guys, another one. We've annihilated it. And as I say guys, this is a bloody team effort thing. Give yourselves a big bloody pat on the back. Now I don't know if I should be including some elevator music for this part. You know, this is, this is the best part though, isn't it? You know, you're just watching the levels drop and all of a sudden, boom sucks away yeah nah guys I'm thinking the same thing that was a pretty piss poor effort of a, a suction sound I know yeah guys while this tank's draining away I just got a just a quick thank you to everyone you know the support keeps coming in you guys are bloody brilliant each and every single one of you you're all legends you know from all around the world now keep sending me their messages and let me know where you're from or what you're up to I've got the usual suspects that message me every week I've got new subscribers that have just started messaging every one of you I really appreciate it guys it means the bloody world to me and every single person that's messaged me I'll, I'll guarantee you I'll reply because I appreciate you anyway guys look at this I think we're uh, yeah there we go she's draining that's what we want to see I mean, look, guys, if that if that just doesn't make your day, I, I don't know what will. Better grab this rubbish or we'll have another block drain, won't we? Now, if you're only new to the channel, guys, I've made uh, a heap of videos on how grease traps actually work. I, you know, I've explained it in a few, and I'm, I'm just conscious to me older subscribers, they're probably getting sick of me talking about grease traps, so I, look, I just thought I'd let you know. There's our German friend, friend of the channel. We'll give the, uh, we'll give the inlet a blast and just make sure that there's nothing inside the drain before we put the lids back on. It's just that sort of, that sort of service we provide, isn't it guys? Making sure everything's 110%. The other day there's a silly sausage in the comments going oh that it looks like a bloody milkshake you know what you're clearing out the drains and I'm thinking mate it's it's far from a bloody milkshake you just wouldn't want to even think about it obviously you've thought about it just don't think about it here's some nice hot soapy water that we prepared earlier guys turn this valve on make sure she starts to drain we'll have a stroll over to the grease trap and see if we can beat that water let's have a look See if it's running nice and clear. Look, it looks like we've beaten the water, I hope. It was a block. There we go. There we are, guys. Job well done. Flowing bloody beautifully. Well, I think it's pack up time, guys. But you know the drill. Before we shoot, we're going to clean this place up 
leaving it looking new. Throw a bit of soapy disinfectant down. Get the old squirty bottle out. Another friend of the channel, old squirty bottle. Come to think about it, I think old squirty bottles bloody made an appearance in the last, oh, probably in the last five or six videos. Now I thought I'd give this drain a little bit of a blast. It's a, looking a little blocked, isn't it? Don't know where it runs. And give it a good clean. Absolutely soak me boots. Now my older subscribers know. Newer subscribers or newer viewers, you may not know. This is the most important part of the job. You leave the place clean, you get a phone call back. You leave it in a pigsty, mate, they're just going to call the next person. Doesn't matter if you've done the job, you leave a mess, you won't hear from them again. It's like I had this mechanic the other day, you know, serving us in the van, and uh, when I jumped in, there's bloody oil prints all over my steering wheel. You know, he changed the oil and he got oil bloody oily hands all over me steering wheel mate you know it's like yeah bloody hell mate you know it's it's not ideal i mean that's not the only thing he did he left the bloody the car parked half on the verge half on the road don't know if he was pissed or what mate but anyway you know what i'm trying to get at all right guys we're out of that one now on to the next uh but look another happy client it's what we want to see now guys, wherever you are in the world, you might just want to take the day off after that. You've, you've been a bloody great help. Tell your boss, Bruce said you got the day off. Anyway, no more kangaroo spotting for me. I'm on the way to the next one. But guys, until next time, I'll catch you bloody later.